HP, Intel, Microsoft, Twitter, Google, Facebook, and Apple. You can find these world leaders in one place, Silicon Valley. If you're lucky enough, you can watch the CEO of Apple talking with the CEO of Google in a cafe with a cup of coffee. Silicon Valley is home to many of the world's largest high-tech corporations as well as thousands of tech startup companies. And it is working as a leading hub for high-tech innovation and development, accounting for one-third of all of the venture capital investment in the U.S. It is located near San Francisco. A lot of people have tried to enter Silicon Valley because it has a unique culture and ecosystem to promote innovation. One, the greatest concentration of venture capital. Two, talents from all over the globe, major universities and research centers, and legal and work environment suitable for development work and fast growing businesses. China, a nation with the world's second largest economy, has its own Silicon Valley in Beijing. It is called Songguangkun. Songguangkun, a technology hub which has gathered nearly 20,000 high and new tech enterprises and has formed a high and new tech industrial cluster during the past two decades. The first person who envisioned the future of Songguangkun was Chen Chunxian, a member of the Chinese Academy of Sciences came up with the idea for a Silicon Valley in China after he visited the U.S. as part of a government-sponsored trip. The Zongguangkun National Demonstration Zone dates back to the Zongguangkun Electronics Street in the, year, in the early 1980s. In May 1988, the State Council approved the establishment of the Beijing New Technology Industrial Development Trial Zone. Thus, Songguangkun became the first high-tech park in China. Tremendous number of startups are taking place in Songguangkun these days. Moreover, people who operated their company abroad come back to China in order to settle in Songguangkun. And now, there are more than 5,000 enterprises with at least 15,000 overseas returnees. The entrepreneur representatives include Lenovo President Liu Chuanzi and Li Yanhong, President of Baidu and Kaifu Li, Google Greater China's former CEO and the President of Innovation Works. Today, the number of listed companies in the zone adds up to 189, comprising of 113 domestic and 76 overseas companies. According to the statistical data of enterprises from January to October 2014, the total income of Zongguangkun Science Park reached 2.57 trillion yuan, with a year-on-year -year increase of 19%. The gross industrial output value reached 690.8 billion yuan, accounting for over 40% of Beijing's overall figure. The current employee population reached 1.72 million with a year-on-year -year growth of 4.2 percent. The actual paid-in taxes reached 146.81 billion yuan with a year-on-year -year growth of 29.2 percent. The gross profit was 193.16 billion yuan with a year-on-year -year growth of 36.9 percent. The total export volume was 25.58 billion with a year-on-year -year growth of 13%, occupying nearly half of the city's total. From January to October 2014, the enterprises in Zongguangkun applied for 32,514 patents in total, seeing a year-on-year -year growth of 14.9%. Nearly 60% of them are patents of invention bringing the total number to 19,293 with a year-on-year -year growth of 17.7%. The enterprises in Zongguangkun have obtained 18,659 patents with a year-on-year -year growth of 5.2%. Among these, 6,300 are patents of invention with a year-on-year -year growth of 11.2%. 
Songguan Kun plans to establish a national SNT financial innovation center that involves government and social funds, industrial and financial capital, and direct and indirect finances. Always be sensitive at Zongguan Kun if you want great success in your life.